Ceux qui ont voulu le meurtrir en frappant délibérément... Ceux qui ont voulu le meurtrir en délibérément frappant innocent people sont des cowards. Désarmés. They shot at an unarmed crowd. But we are not engaged in a war of civilization because these killers do not represent a civilization. We are at a war against jihadist terrorism. So proclaimed French President François Hollande Monday, objecting to what many have framed as a civilizational war against Europe. This as moments of silence were held across the continent in memory of the victims of the terror attacks in Paris. And as the identities of some of those killed emerge, the scope of the attack is becoming abundantly clear. The victims of 19 different nationalities came from all over the world. Marie and Matthias from Metz in France, they were both killed at the Bataclan. Miko, 47, from Belgium, and Alif, just 26, from Turkey. They had been living in Paris for four months. Michali, 27, came from Mexico. She got engaged in late October. Priscilla, 35, was from Portugal. Juan Gonzalez, 29, from Madrid. He was also killed at the Bataclan concert. Valentin, just 26, was a lawyer with the Paris office of an international law firm. And Noemi, 23, was a senior at California State University in Long Beach. Also on Monday, a much-anticipated condemnation from the head of the Grand Mosque in Paris. Islam Islam does not associate itself with acts of terrorism in the slightest, something that is said very commonly by these killers, these slaughters, these assassins. They are assassins who are killing people. Let us call those who are assassins by their rightful name and leave religion out of their terrible acts because that serves as a cover for them to justify the unjustifiable. The head of the mosque seemed to echo Hollande's assumption that this was not a war of civilization. But the French president also took the opportunity to make it clear that now that the real target has been identified, his government will not hesitate to retaliate. The enemy uses the vilest ways to try to kill us, but they will not escape us. I will even be more precise. The enemy is not out of our reach.